We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. He's knocked out of bounds right around the 30. The Wildcats in talking with them this week, Kirk, it's just interesting their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'd be shocked if they can slow him down. Runs it, and he stopped short of the line of scrimmage. The D-line did a good job of nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. From their own 41-yard line, second down. Throws it in a hurry, and he hits him hard at the 50. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. Nearly intercepted. What? This is a great play by the safety to be able to be in a position to make this play, but he's got to be able to hold on to the football. You know, he's a big, physical, athletic guy, but you've got to be able to secure a football and make a big play when it presents itself. And it goes out of bounds at the five-yard line. He was able to deaden that kick perfectly, and he gives them a long field to work with. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. They come out in a goal line set. Here's the halfback. And he's leveled at the seven-yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own seven. Three down, three down. Mike, check, 33. Ready, check, check. 98, weasel. And he just gets rid of it. Man left, man left. Three down, three down. Hey, check, Mike, 33. Check, ready. Black with the five. Uh -huh. Defense coming and the ball comes out. Offense has it, but that'll be a safety. What an effort by the defense, and they move ahead. That's a huge play by these guys. Forcing a safety to give your team the lead and get the ball back is what some of these defensive players dream of. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. Arizona holds just a two-point lead. He's taken down. 38. They'll keep it on the ground again. And he's taken down at about the 47-yard line. Gets to about the 47-yard line. And they keep it on the ground for the first down. Nothing too fancy here. The key is that the running back was able to convert the first down. Tackle after a decent run up the gun. That'll make it second and four. Under pressure. Catches it, gets out of bounds. 
So they gain six yards on the play and pick up the first down. Heads up play by the quarterback to find his receiver in traffic and get the ball into his hands. And the quarterback took a pretty good shot there, but he still got the ball where it had to go. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Second down, about 12 yards to go. Ball on the 43. Again, he'll get the call. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. That's some daylight. It's complete. And he's tackled right around the 24-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Arizona is up two. And they make the stop at the 25-yard line. Never really had a shot. They were on him almost as soon as he took the handoff. This is the tenth play of this drive. I don't think he got anything on that. He's hit and taken down. Well, they're living on the edge here a little bit, but you know, they're converting when they have to. That makes it first and goal. He's tackled right away. That's a That brings him second and goal. Touchdown, Wildcats. Big extra point here. It'll put him up by two scores. And he converts the extra point. A 13-play, 63-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. And they can forget about returning this one. They need to show a little giddy-up now, because if they don't start eating into this deficit, they could easily fall out of the game. Takes it right, and he can't get back to the line. No game. That makes it second and ten. Second down, ten yards to go. Ball on the 25. Watch number five. Watch number five. Let's go. Now he's scrambling. And he is drilled at the 26-yard line. Gain of one yard. That'll make it 39. Yeah, let's get a sack lunch. Mike, check 33. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. From their own 41 yard line. First down. He's going to try and scramble. He lets it fly. Got a man. Watch out here. They'll bring him down at the nine-yard line. A long way is yet to go, but at the end of one, Wildcats lead it by nine. And we're ready for more football here in quarter number two. Mike Schick, 33. 33. And he makes it out to about the eight-yard line. It's second and goal. Eight yards out. And a quick throw. Knocked out of bounds around the one-yard line. 
Texas in the ball. Him up. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Loss of two yards on the way. That brings up fourth and goal. The offense is staying on the field. It's all or nothing. Here we go. All the big boys are on the field now. Both teams have their big sets out there. I'm not going to fault that decision. It was definitely a first down that they could have picked up. You want to be aggressive early on, even if it doesn't always work out. You really can't say enough about this defense. Fourth and short, and they really showed up on that play. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead, and on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's a team of seven. That'll bring up second and three. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. The halfback with a carry. Tackle at the 16. Call it a gain of eight yards. First down. Brought down at the 17. Gain of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. Next to one, next to one. Got it! Zach Nye! Yo, Jeremy! Hey, I need one over here. I need one. And down he goes at about the 25 yard line. That'll make it third and one. Takes it and he's tackled short. That'll make it fourth and two. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He makes it to the 38-yard line. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Tackle made to the 34-yard line. You know, it looked to me like he should have made the pitch, but he kept it instead and wound up going backwards. Second down, 13 yards to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. He's out of bounds at the 45-yard line. From the 46 yard line, it's first down. Loss of two on the run by the halfback. That is a loss of two yards. That'll bring up second and 11. Taken down to the 38 yard line. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. Hand off, and he won't make it. That's a great play by the defense. There's nothing like a defense being able to slip off of a block, get into the backfield of the offense, and then make a play in the backfield to be able to create some momentum possibly for this defense. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. Six 
Watson. The Wildcats game plan is just what we've been seeing through a couple of quarters now. Give this guy the football and let him ram it down the defense's throat and just keep giving it to him until he gets tired or the defense gets tired. Uh, the offensive line, I also think, deserves a lot of credit. You know, the, the back is the star. He's been getting most of the yards and most of the attention, but he's not doing it alone. The offensive line's paving the way and opening this thing up, and, and the running back's taking advantage of it. They've had a great first half. Gets it out to the wideout, and he's got the first. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want them. First and ten. Ball on their own 23. Four down, four down. Hey, watch 11, watch 11. He's tackled in the open field. That's the kind of play calling and execution I like to see. Being one-dimensional on first down can really stack the odds against you. It's better to mix it up. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's taken down around the 47-yard line. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. Caught with room to work, and they push him out at the 34. From the 34-yard line, first down. <laughs> Mike one, Mike one. <laughs> Throws out and through his hands. Number 29 was his intended receiver on the play. Left, left. That makes it second and 10. Here we go, oh, here we go, oh. One for Mike, watch one, watch yeah. one. Yeah, the way he is. He airs it out. Got it! Touchdown, Wildcats! He splits the uprights with the extra point. Arizona lines up for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Their last drive ended in a punt, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. And he can't get away from the pressure. The smart quarterbacks and offensive linemen have a really unique relationship. A quarterback should take care of his offensive linemen. But after that play and that hit, you really got to be wondering what kind of relationship this quarterback and his offensive linemen have after that. We're halfway through, and it's been a good one. 16 to nothing, Wildcats. We played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Nobody's been able to run the football in the first half. Neither ground game really got anything going. And you know, an offensive line, David, has to work in unison. They have to be like the Rockettes. They have to be in perfect step. And these guys, they were dancing to their own tune. Just the biggest Rockettes I've ever seen. Goodness gracious. Ugliest ones, too. Yeah. Uh, well, the big fat boys do have to work together. The big uglies, and they got to step together. But And you can't allow guys to run through clear. And you, and you see tackles for a loss, especially in the run game when it's this unsuccessful in the first half. You know they're not all working together, and there's too many guys that are getting penetration and making plays, so they got to get it shored up. Run blocking is the thing they like to do the best. They like to get their big meat hooks on you, grab you, and hold you. And you know, to be honest, they got to do a better job of it if they want to get some successful running game going in the second half. Just about time to get you back out for the second half. Brad and Kirk will be along in just a second. You're looking forward to keeping an eye on everything around the country here. Got a good. Well, like a game school. We're locked and loaded. We got all the big screens going. You're gonna be looking to hand out some helmet stickers later. Yeah. We loaded, man. I'll try. You think you can keep on your shoes in the second half? I'll try to. They stinky? <laughs> yes. Brad and Kirk, you are at a safe distance. Take it away. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. 
He sends this one deep. Arizona's the type of team, when you look at them, it looks like their defense sort of just feeds off itself. I think the energy is there, Brad, but I think it really starts up front with their defensive line and their linebackers, the way they're being able to just win the battle at the line of scrimmage. I think it's giving them confidence, and it's allowing them to play more downhill where they can attack this offense. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 35. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. the corner he's at midfield and they tackle him at the 39 that was a huge lift Brad you're right a run like that can really get the momentum rolling defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down and 10 to go. Let's go! Ball on the 39. They come out in a five-wide set. Gets it. He's in space. And he's tackled at about the 29-yard line. receiver and he tackles him hard at the 21. From the 21 yard line. First down. Quick throw out to the receiver. That's a great tackle at the 13. This defense is looking to make it three straight trips to the red zone without a single point. Here's a screen pass, gets it to the back. They'll drop in for a loss. Call the loss of four yards on the way. That'll bring up third and six. This is the play of this drive. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun, five wide receivers. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. He gets it up, and he's got it. to kick this one away. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. We're about set to start things up again. He gets to about the 34-yard line. Makes it out to about the 43. He's under pressure. Going deep. Missed him. Accuracy is such a vital part of being a quarterback. You've got to have an ability to lay the ball right into your guys' hands. From their own 43-yard line, second down. And he carries the ball for a nice game. And they make 
the stop at the 48-yard line. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. First down grab. And he shoved out of bounds right around the 40. First down. Get him in the backfield for a loss. Those linebackers do a great job of stopping the run, but they need to be careful of the play action pass. You can easily get fooled and give up some big yards through the air. From the 43 yard line, it's second down. He fights forward to about the 43, and the halfback's got nowhere to go. Defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack. And somehow, he's able to throw the ball away. They're trying to pin them deep with a solid punt right here. And this one is a beauty. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Zips it to the back. Good tackle there in space. From their own 21-yard line, second down. They come out on an empty backfield. Fires out to his receiver. They'll bring him down at the 35-yard line. Hit out of bounds at about the 49. From their own 49 yard line, it's first down. Pulls down the catch and he's got room here. Four yards on that play. He took what the defense gave him that time, which is okay. It keeps the yards to go a little bit more manageable. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 47. Three down, three down. Ready! Check, check. Easy, easy, easy. He goes downtown. And a great catch. For the 10. Touchdown, Cal. Converts the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 25. Their last drive broke down and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? Arizona with a six-point lead. Makes it to the 41. Makes the catch, and the defense is all over him. They bring him down for a loss. We head to the final quarter, and we've got a great game on our hands. Wildcats in front by six. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. They'll 
wrestle him down to the backfield. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 49. Throws it deep. The junior makes the catch. So the kicker's going to stay on the sidelines. These guys will try for a two-point conversion. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. He's got it for two. So with under five minutes to go here in the fourth, the score, 24-10, Arizona. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The offense now will take the field, and they hope to have the same success they had on their last drive. Second and five, ball on their own 30. He's scrambling. Tackle to 39 yard line. Yard line. That's good to have gained four yards. That makes it second and six. From their own 43 yard line, it's second down. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Ready! Ready! Brought down around the 49 yard line. by the defense of getting after that quarterback and right now I think they've got him with some happy feet he appears to be a bit rattled second down 10 to go ball on the 49 yard line and he's taken down at the 40 yard line receiver in a hurry. He's taken down at the 24. There's very good chemistry between these two. They like to run through all their routes before the game. And I have to say, they look sharp before this one even started. They bring him down. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard. I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. Just under three to go in regulation. He's tackled around the three yard line. and goal from the two, and they can smell the end zone. Quick strike to the receiver. Touchdown. point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. 
he just drills this one. Well, this is turning into a shootout here. Now, remember, the last time we saw this offense out in the field, they answered the bell and scored a touchdown. Can they do that now a second time? You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Hands it off. Good outside run there. to pick up the first down. Just under two minutes in the game. California's going to have to use their second time out of the half. A yard, maybe two on the carry. Now there's going to be some time left on the clock after this punt. The defense had better be ready because this game is going to be on them. They get this one off and it's a beauty. He's tackled at the 28-yard line. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack a defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have done an outstanding job in being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks, and the quarterback put the ball right on the money. Second and 10, ball on the 28-yard line. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Fires out to his wideout. He wants it all going long. And he's tackled at the 22 yard line. After the big pass play, we've got a first down. Five wide. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And he is drilled at the 15. The spike will stop the clock. Under a minute left. Mike six, 33. Gets it to his wide receiver, and he's got another one. What a play, and that is first and goal. This is the eighth play of the drive. That brings up second and goal. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. He's on the run. Keeps it, and he's got a touchdown.
There's will be tied with the extra point. Here's the call from the referee. Delayed, Delayed game, game. Offense. offense. He makes the PAT late in the fourth quarter, and with that score, we are now tied. And the way things are going, we might be going to an extra session or two. They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. The worst thing that should happen for the offense now is that the game will go into overtime. If they can make a couple of plays, then maybe they'll pull it out in regulation. Ready! Ready! That's a great tackle at the 18-yard line. I think that one's on the offensive line. They've got to do a better job of holding their blocks, or else this quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. Quick throw, and he's hit immediately. A gain of six. Well, he really didn't have to do too much there to give himself a little room to make the catch. Third and 11. Ball on the 24-yard line. Well, that's just a huge stop right there here late in the fourth quarter to gain this tight. That might be one we look back on later and say that won the ball game. He really got a hold of that one. They'll bring him down at the 31. Late in the fourth quarter, tie football game, an important game for both these teams, and this is where you find out who your leaders are. And I think they're going to take one last shot at the end zone here. He airs it out. That close to being intercepted. That's the end of the fourth quarter, and we are headed to overtime. Back to the action here, and we get ready for overtime. Gets it. He's in space. They'll bring him down at the 12. That's good for a gain of 13 yards. That makes it first and 10. Quickly, and they got it. Touchdown. And he hits the PAT. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Here we go. Deep ball, laying it out there. It's picked off, and that's the game. And he's level at the one-yard line. So this one goes final. A hard-fought close game. Arizona 31, California 24. That brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Curb Street, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.